Hi, well, it's Mike Simonson again. Uh, hope you remember me from the introductory module to this course, and obviously we all had a chance to meet each other at summer conference. But now we're ready to start the last unit in this course. And we think this uh, unit will be fairly straightforward. It's where we're going to kind of tie all the loose ends together and especially focus on you as a person who is entering the ITDE field, the Instructional Technology and Distance Education field. Um, looking at my notes here, by the way, I'm here in my, we call, I call it my dog office, um, uh, for, for obvious reasons in the background. Uh, it's where I'm teaching uh, from for the summer. For the last several months, we've talked about the field of instructional technology and distance education. We've looked at the literature, we've looked at the research, we looked at dissertations, we looked at what the, the field says are its fundamental foundations, and now we're going to tie it all together by looking at you, by concentrating on you, by concentrating on the person who is going to become the professional in instructional technology and distance education. There's two assignments for this unit. One is to write a very short position paper and there's a template for that position paper posted in Blackboard. I'll say a little more about that in a second. And the second assignment is to produce a short video where you explain in video, on a video, your position related to your current or emerging role as a scientist, scholar, and practitioner, rather than as a practitioner in instructional technology and distance education. Um, a doctoral program is supposed to be transformative. All of you were professionals in your own right, in your own field, before you entered this doctoral program. You were teachers. You were trainers. You were uh, leaders. You were uh, in some other field. And you decided to enter the instructional technology and doctoral program so that you could transform yourself, whether you realize it or not, into a scholar, a scientist, a researcher and a person who is a leader in the field of instructional technology and distance education. Well, we're just beginning that process. Um, but now what we want you to do is to articulate, to write, and then to say where you were, where you are, and where you hope to be as you move through this doctoral program and as you become a member of the instructional technology and distance education field. Um, as I said, uh, there is a template in Blackboard for the written document, relatively short, just basically fill in the blanks, but it's the what you fill those blanks in with that is of critical importance. And then I want you to take that statement after you post it in Blackboard, send it to me. Obviously, this is a doctoral level course, so I have to grade it, and make a short video uh, doesn't have to be very fancy, that you post in YouTube or on your personal website or some social media location where you can keep it, share it with me so I can grade it, where you can keep it and refer back to it as your career in this doctoral program unfolds. And that'll be it for, for the rest of this course. Obviously, Dr. Slosser and Dr. Oriana have other assignments for you to complete. There are other assignments for you to complete, but that's pretty much it. And this will all wrap up here uh, in the next couple of weeks as this semester draws to a conclusion. I hope that helps. Obviously, you can contact me anytime via email, and if, if we can make a, if you want to talk, we can make arrangements so I can call you so that we can talk about this one-on-one. -on -one. But have fun with this one. I think this is a chance for you to tell us who you are and what you want to be in the ITDE field. Have fun.